Melk Abbey, located in Austria, is one of the most renowned monastic sites in Europe. Situated on a rocky outcrop overlooking the Danube River, it stands as a symbol of Austrian Baroque architecture and Benedictine monasticism. Founded in 1089, Melk Abbey has a rich history spanning over a millennium. The current abbey complex was mostly built between the 18th and 19th centuries, with extensive renovations and expansions undertaken during the Baroque period under the guidance of architect Jacob Prantauer. The abbey's architecture is characterized by its grandeur and opulence, reflecting the wealth and power of the Benedictine order during the Baroque era. The highlight of the complex is the stunning Abbey Church, a masterpiece of Baroque design adorned with frescoes, sculptures, and intricate ornamentation. In addition to its architectural splendor, Melk Abbey is also renowned for its extensive library, which houses a vast collection of medieval manuscripts, incunabula, and other rare books. The library's stunning interior features, elaborate frescoes, and stucco work, creating a truly awe-inspiring atmosphere. Today, Melk Abbey continues to serve as a functioning Benedictine monastery, as well as a popular tourist destination, attracting visitors from around the world who come to admire its beauty, learn about its history, and experience the tranquility of its surroundings. Kiev Pechersk Lavra, also known as the Kiev Monastery of the Caves, is one of the most significant religious and cultural landmarks in Ukraine. Located on the hills overlooking the Dnipro River in Kiev, the Lavra is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a symbol of Ukrainian spirituality and identity. Founded in 1051 by St. Anthony and St. Theodosius, Kiev Pechersk Lavra is one of the oldest Eastern Orthodox monasteries in Eastern Europe. It played a crucial role in the spread of Christianity in the region and became a center of religious and cultural life. The Lavra complex is comprised of several architectural and historical monuments, including churches, cathedrals, bell towers, and underground caves. The Dormition Cathedral, rebuilt in the 18th century, is the Lavra's main church and houses the relics of St. Anthony and St. Theodosius. One of the most unique features of Kiev Pechersk Lavra is its network of underground caves where numerous monks lived and were buried. These catacombs, known as the Near Caves and the Far Caves, became a pilgrimage site for Orthodox Christians and are still visited by thousands of believers each year. Throughout its history, Kiev Pechersk Lavra has faced numerous challenges including invasions, wars, and Soviet-era persecution. However, it has managed to preserve its spiritual significance and cultural heritage, attracting visitors from around the world who come to admire its architecture, explore its history, and experience the tranquility of its surroundings. Kinkakuji, also known as the Golden Pavilion, is a Zen Buddhist temple located in Kyoto, Japan. It is one of the most iconic and visually stunning landmarks in the country, renowned for its breathtaking golden exterior and serene garden setting. Originally built in the 14th century as a retirement villa for Ashikaga Yoshimitsu, a powerful shogun, Kinkakuji was later converted into a Zen temple following his death as per his wishes. The temple's top two floors are completely covered in gold leaf giving it a majestic and radiant appearance that reflects on the surrounding pond, creating a picturesque scene. The architectural style of Kinkaku-ji blends traditional Japanese aesthetics with influences from Zen Buddhism. The first floor, known as the Hosui Inn, features simple and elegant designs, while the upper floors exhibit more ornate details and intricate craftsmanship. Surrounding the Golden Pavilion is a meticulously landscaped garden known as the Kyoko-chi Mirror Pond Garden. The garden is designed in a traditional Japanese style with carefully placed rocks, trees, and moss-covered pathways that create a tranquil and harmonious atmosphere. Despite facing destruction by fire several times throughout its history, including a devastating arson attack in 1950, Kinkakuji has been faithfully reconstructed each time, maintaining its original splendor and
Wat Rong Khun, also known as the White Temple, is a contemporary Buddhist temple located in Chiang Rai Province, Thailand. It stands out for its unique and unconventional design, characterized by its brilliant white exterior and intricate ornamentation. The temple was designed by Thai artist Chalermshai Kosit Pipat, who embarked on the project in 1997 with the goal of creating an unconventional and thought-provoking religious monument. Unlike traditional Thai temples, Wat Rong Khun features contemporary elements and incorporates symbolic imagery from Buddhist and Hindu mythology. The exterior of the temple is adorned with sparkling white plaster and glass mosaic, which gives it a surreal and ethereal appearance, especially when illuminated by sunlight. As visitors approach the temple, they are greeted by a bridge over a small lake, symbolizing the journey from the cycle of rebirth to the realm of enlightenment. The interior of Wat Rong Khun is equally mesmerizing, with intricate murals and sculptures depicting scenes from Buddhist teachings, as well as contemporary pop culture references and political motifs. The main assembly hall houses a stunning white Buddha statue surrounded by ornate carvings and decorations. Wat Rong Khun is not just a religious site, but also a work of art that reflects the artist's vision and commentary on contemporary society. It has become a popular tourist destination in Thailand, attracting visitors from around the world who come to admire its beauty, explore its symbolism, and contemplate its message of spiritual enlightenment and social awareness. The Taj Mahal is an iconic symbol of India and one of the most famous architectural wonders in the world. Located in Agra, Uttar Pradesh, it is renowned for its stunning beauty, intricate craftsmanship, and rich historical significance. Commissioned in 1632 by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan in memory of his beloved wife, Mumtaz Mahal, who died during childbirth, the Taj Mahal stands as a testament to their eternal love. It took approximately 2,000 artisans and laborers over 20 years to complete this magnificent mausoleum, which is considered one of the finest examples of Mughal architecture. The Taj Mahal is made entirely of white marble, adorned with intricate inlay work using precious and semi-precious stones, such as jade, lapis lazuli, turquoise, and amethyst. Its symmetrical design is characterized by a central dome surrounded by four minarets, reflecting the perfect harmony and balance of Mughal architectural principles. The beauty of the Taj Mahal is further enhanced by its meticulously landscaped gardens, reflecting pools and symmetrical pathways, creating a serene and tranquil atmosphere that invites contemplation and reflection. Recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, the Taj Mahal attracts millions of visitors from around the globe each year, drawn by its breathtaking beauty and profound historical significance. It is not only a symbol of love, but also a testament to the architectural and artistic achievements of the Mughal Empire, leaving an indelible mark on the cultural landscape of India and the world. Angkor Wat is a majestic temple complex located in the province of Siem Reap, Cambodia. It is one of the most significant archaeological sites in Southeast Asia and is renowned for its stunning architecture, intricate carvings, and profound historical and cultural significance. Built in the early 12th century during the reign of King Suryavarman II of the Khmer Empire, Angkor Wat was originally constructed as a Hindu temple dedicated to the god Vishnu. However, it gradually transformed into a Buddhist temple over the centuries. The temple complex covers an area of over 162 hectares, 400 acres, and is surrounded by a vast moat symbolizing the cosmic ocean. Its most distinctive feature is its towering central spire, which rises to a height of over 65 meters, 213 feet, and represents Mount Meru, the mythical abode of the gods in Hindu and Buddhist cosmology. The walls of Angkor Wat are adorned with elaborate bas-reliefs and carvings depicting scenes from Hindu mythology, historical events, and everyday life during the Khmer Empire. These intricate artworks are a testament to the skill and craftsmanship of the Khmer artisans who built the temple. Despite facing periods of neglect and decay, Angkor Wat has been remarkably well-preserved 
and has undergone extensive restoration efforts in recent decades. It is now a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a symbol of Cambodia's cultural heritage, attracting millions of visitors from around the world who come to marvel at its beauty, learn about its history and experience its spiritual significance. Wat Sheng Thong is a renowned Buddhist temple located in Luang Prabang, Laos. It is one of the most important monasteries in the country and is celebrated for its elegant architecture, intricate artwork and historical significance. Built in 1560 by King Setatharath, Wat Sheng Thong served as a royal temple and a centre of religious and cultural activities during the Lan Sang Kingdom. The temple's name translates to Golden City Temple or Temple of the Golden City, reflecting its former grandeur and importance. The architectural style of Wat Sheng Thong is typical of Lao temple design, featuring a multi-tiered roof with sweeping, upward curving eaves adorned with intricate wood carvings and gold leaf decorations. The main ordination hall, or Sim, is adorned with elaborate gilded stencils and murals depicting Buddhist legends and motifs. One of the highlights of Wat Sieng Thong is its Tree of Life mosaic, located on the rear wall of the Sim. This stunning mosaic depicts the story of the Buddha's journey to enlightenment, surrounded by intricate floral and animal motifs. Surrounding the main structures of the temple are beautifully landscaped gardens, stone stupas, and other smaller shrines, creating a serene and peaceful atmosphere for meditation and contemplation. Wat Sieng Thong is not only a religious site, but also a cultural treasure and a symbol of Laotian identity. It is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a popular tourist destination, attracting visitors from around the world who come to admire its architecture, explore its history, and experience the spiritual ambience of its surroundings. The Shwedagun Pagoda is one of the most sacred and iconic Buddhist sites in Myanmar, formerly known as Burma. Located in Yangon, the country's largest city, the pagoda is renowned for its magnificent golden stupa, which dominates the city's skyline and glistens in the sunlight. Believed to have been built over 2,600 years ago, the Shwedagon Pagoda enshrines relics of the Gautama Buddha, including strands of his hire. Throughout its long history, the pagoda has been renovated and expanded multiple times, resulting in its current grandeur and splendor. The central stupa, standing at a height of over 99 meters, 326 feet, is covered in thousands of gold plates and adorned with numerous diamonds, rubies, and other precious gemstones. At its crown, the stupa is topped by a large diamond orb, known as the diamond bud, which is encrusted with thousands of diamonds and other gems. Surrounding the central stupa are smaller stupas, shrines and pavilions, as well as a labyrinth of covered walkways and staircases leading to various levels of the complex. The entire pagoda complex is meticulously maintained and is a bustling centre of religious activity with devotees and visitors alike coming to pay their respects, make offerings and meditate. The Shwedagon Pagoda is not only a religious site, but also a symbol of national pride and identity for the people of Myanmar. It is a place of pilgrimage for Buddhists from around the world and a popular tourist destination, drawing visitors who come to marvel at its beauty, experience its spiritual significance and soak in the atmosphere of reverence and devotion that permeates the site. The Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque is a magnificent architectural masterpiece and one of the most prominent landmarks in the United Arab Emirates, located in the capital city of Abu Dhabi. Named after the late Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nahyan, the founding father and first president of the UAE. The mosque is a symbol of Islamic art, culture and spirituality. Construction of the Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque began in 1996 
and was completed in 2007. It blends various architectural styles from different Islamic civilizations, incorporating elements of Mughal, Moorish and Ottoman architecture, among others. The result is a stunning fusion of traditional and contemporary design, with intricate details and grand proportions. The mosque is notable for its sheer size and grandeur, featuring 82 domes, more than 1,000 columns, and a central prayer hall that can accommodate up to 4,000 worshippers. The main dome, adorned with white marble and intricate floral patterns, rises to a height of 85 meters, 279 feet, and is one of the largest mosque domes in the world. The exterior of the mosque is clad in white marble and adorned with intricate floral designs, semi-precious stones, and gold embellishments. The courtyard, surrounded by reflective pools, features intricate marble mosaics and lush landscaping, creating a serene and peaceful atmosphere. Inside the mosque, the prayer hall is adorned with massive crystal chandeliers, intricate carpets, and exquisite calligraphy, creating a sense of awe and reverence. The mosque also houses one of the world's largest hand-knotted carpets, measuring over 5,600 square meters and weighing more than 12 tons. The Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque is not only a place of worship, but also a cultural and educational center welcoming visitors of all faiths to learn about Islam and admire its architectural and artistic splendor. It serves as a symbol of tolerance, unity, and cultural exchange, reflecting the vision and values of the UAE's founding father, Sheikh Zayed. The Temple of the Emerald Buddha, known as Wat Phra Kayo in Thai, is one of the most revered and sacred Buddhist temples in Thailand. Located within the grounds of the Grand Palace Complex in Bangkok, it is a symbol of Thai spirituality, culture, and monarchy. The temple is home to the Emerald Buddha, a highly venerated and meticulously carved statue of the meditating Buddha in a seated position. Despite its name, the statue is actually carved from a single piece of jadeite rather than emerald. It is considered the Palladium of Thailand, representing the spiritual and protective power of the Thai monarchy. The history of the Emerald Buddha dates back to the 14th century, when it was discovered in Chiang Rai, northern Thailand. It has since been housed in various temples across the country before finding its permanent home at Wat Phra Keu in Bangkok. The Temple of the Emerald Buddha is renowned for its stunning architecture and intricate decorations. The main Ubosot ordination hall is adorned with intricate gold leaf motifs, colorful murals, and ornate wood carvings, creating a visually stunning and spiritually uplifting atmosphere. The temple complex also features several other buildings and structures, including chedis, stupas, viharas, halls, and pavilions, each with its own unique architectural style and historical significance. The Temple of the Emerald Buddha is not only a place of worship but also a major tourist attraction, drawing visitors from around the world who come to admire its beauty, learn about its history, and experience the rich cultural heritage of Thailand. It holds a central place in Thai religious and cultural life and is deeply revered by the Thai people as a symbol of their faith and identity.